Okay guys, hello, Malik J1 here and today I'm going to be showing you guys a little guide on how to install the Thermorite Silver Arrow SBE Extreme on the AMD 6100. And here we go. First I'll be showing you how to take off the standard mounting hardware for the AMD 6100 and first off I'm going to show you how to remove the standard mounting hardware by just undoing a set of these four screws here that you should see just undo these it shouldn't really be that hard to take out you know it should should just come on right out like with it without any real force and after you undo this screw on this side this little plastic piece here you should be able to um, take right off with no problem and then that exposes the little th um, I guess little peaks that come through the motherboard that uh, hooks against the back plate and you can see this one come off here and you would see me lift up the motherboard and show you for back plate right there and that's what the back plate looks like that little white piece you see there is plastic to protect the motherboard from short circuiting and now I'm showing you the silver arrow mounting bracket which is a pretty thick piece of metal like solid not going nowhere and what you need to do is put four screws into the AMD mounting holes and four washers should be put over one in over each individual screw these these washers have a little a little taller than their other ones so we can go straight through the motherboard and as you see there this screw should just be sticking out through and you use these to screw into them with the plastic facing down and after you get all four of those screws in you're gonna use this this top bracket to mount them and the top bracket you're not, that little notch you see there it's that's what it's going you're going to basically screw it through but it's not really going to go through it it's just going to be sitting beside it but holding it down securely and before we do that we're going to install the 6100 into the socket and after that and after you get all your screws in that's what it should look like we're going to be using the thermal paste arctic silver 5 I'm not going to be using the stock one and this is I recommend recommended how much thermal paste you should use because you don't want to use too much and installing the silver arrow now you make sure you have it in the correct orientation and the hold down bracket that's what basically everything looks like you what you're going to do is just screw in one side and then screw in the other so you don't have any uneven pressure and after everything is done that's how it should look like you can already see that there's not much memory clearance and after installing the stock fans that came with them I'm not going to be using these but that's basically what it's going to look like I'm not using these fans because these fans are hella loud and I'm showing you the clearance in my case the, the f and it, you know 165 millimeters tall and my case right, um, holds 170 millimeters but this is not all and I'll be doing some benchmarks in a second